Hey guys, so for this project, what you need is a canvas, pretty decent size one. I got this at Walmart. I got three for like eight dollars. Crayons, and the most tasking part is taking the wrappers off the crayons. You want to get the most vibrant colors. If you want to do the rainbow or something, you can. It doesn't matter. It depends on how you feel, what it is. You also need, if you have one, a glue gun with glue sticks. If not, you can anything that will stick it to the canvas and not come off when you use a heating gun or a blow dryer. I'll be using, using caulk. I'm going to let that dry overnight and stuff. And yeah. So, right here I'm going to be cutting the paper off of the crayon so I can just take it off real quick, but it happens that some of these crayons are extra stuck to the paper, so it takes a little longer. This part actually took the longest. And also, if you're going to be using a razor blade, be very careful because I almost cut my fingers like four times. So here's the end result. There's a bunch of crap left over. But see you at the gluing stage in the process. I know I've seen a lot of people on YouTube have seen this been done many times different ways. This is how I do it. But as you see, there's little cutouts from the pop figure I have of a Colossus Titan. I cut out three of his heads and bodies, and at the right hand, there's a little word that says pop. I really enjoyed making this. You know, it it was a lot of fun. And I had enough time on my hands to glue it all down and put the colors around. Also, these stars that I glued on to this canvas, I actually printed offline. I got a free picture of star within stars. So that was pretty cool on top of that. It adds to a bigger effect. Thank you. 
Well guys, this is the end result. I think it came out really nice. The colors came out really good. See ya.